Hello my friend, welcome back to Corvette Autos YouTube channel. I came to look at this Corvette, which is for sale locally for $2500. It's a 91 automatic in the dark green color. I was just going to drive by, but then this is what happened. The lady didn't bring the key, unfortunately, she didn't find it, but the car was open, the Corvette was open, so we can look under the hood. We will start here. This side looks pretty okay and normal, right? Everything seems to be in the place. Somehow, I can see here some crazy stuff, the wiring for probably the sound system or something but the computer is here obviously I don't think the valve covers are leaking badly however let's go on look from the other side I want to show you something here we are on the other side let's say the passenger side of the car right and what immediately caught my attention I want to show you there was a bunch of leaves here obviously red nest and look in the detail on those wires. This is what the rats will do to your Corvette or obviously other cars, but right now we are talking Corvettes. Look at it. I know absolutely for sure this is what happened here. So I'm glad I was able to open that the owner says it runs perfectly does this mean it doesn't no because the wire is still intact and i believe that injector is still firing but these are the things everybody has to be aware of obviously right i pulled the dipstick out the transmission dipstick the fluid is darker but it's nice and still clear let's say you know so it'll be one of the first things obviously which I will be dealing with but it's still okay and the engine oil the same story basically the oil is slightly contaminated but no presence of coolant or anything like that so that, that's promising and of course I removed the coolant reservoir cap looks inside and I also don't see any contamination of the coolant by the engine oil or something like that I will always think this is the windshield washer reservoir. Shockingly, it says engine coolant only. Also, look who's driving the funnel with them all the time, sitting here in front. Very interesting. The horn is disconnected. The drive belt with the tensioner and so on. The pulleys, they seem to be okay. I don't see any. Uh, water pump leak or anything like that from seepage holes so this area seems to be pretty okay and it's unfortunately not so great in the interior let's go look inside together I already opened it once I believe that the roof has all that duct tape on it it's really broken because this car can have some pills also if you don't feel good but this standing water this is just water only it's completely filled with the water parts all damaged ripped apart yep not very funny picture in inside and that's what I was saying that will be probably all going and I'm not sure if it can be even used. You see the panels that are not matching over there. Everything is just in really rough shape. Let's see if the, the real hatch will open, right? This is the release button. Oh my God, I'm in, I'm in shock. This is unbelievable. Can you believe this actually opened? This is, this is immediately increasing the price of the vehicle that's for sure also these glasses very very stylish well what do you think my friend is this worth even paying let's say two thousand dollars when this vehicle in such a rough shape and now we even don't know how is it with the title and so on hopefully it can be even transferred 
Other than that, that will be definitely just the parts car. Everything was obviously just sitting for a long time, but obviously this car has power windows and power locks. Uh, there's supposed to be original key for it. Here is the detail of the shifter. They are always, and they are not being kept correctly. I can see always this uh, leather peeling off here. I will say that's a typical problem. Yep, uh, this car is unfortunately in very, very poor shape. And is this even working? You see, this is just the way it is. Everything will have to be worked on, inspected, fixed, repaired, or whatever we say. Oh my god, here is the logo. Corvette logo. Big deal, big deal. Well, my friend, I think that's enough info. I don't have a key for it, as I said. Let's finish it here. The tires are, seems to be on all four corners and really great shape so that's one of the few things which will not have to be replaced or fixed so thanks for watching please give me your expertise and advice what to do with this car if it's even worth two grand or 1500 whatever you will think such a 91 Corvette it's worth thank you once again for watching and have a wonderful day